The registration form is a huge deal in planning. If you've decided to refrain from the online tool route, these example forms will help provide with the layout and details you need to get all the right information from attendees. Keep in mind that this is just a template. It's a basis for your registration sheet and can easily be edited to cater to your event's specific needs. We offer both an individual sign-up form and a family one. And for this video, we're going to use the individual. The event information at the top is where you're going to fill in all the details of your event. The what, who, when, and where. So first things first, we need to name our event. And we're going to call it Kids Camp. And it will be hosted by any church. Our dates are July 10th through 15th but we don't currently have a where listed so let's add that here and our event will be at Lake Williamson Christian Center some people may want to add details here, such as recreation available or keynote speaker, but that should really be given in your promotional strategy. You don't want to overload guests with information on the registration sheet. All they really need to know is about the sign-up process. Hopefully, they've already been given some promotional materials that have convinced them to sign up and shown what you're going to have. The next section is for the attendees to fill out. Again, you can pick and choose what information you want from guests. For example, gender isn't necessary for a men's retreat, but with our kids camp, we're going to need to know if the guest is a boy or a girl to put them in the appropriate lodging. But we want everything else, so we'll leave that section as is. Below that is the rooming options, and this section has a lot of opportunity for how you want to set up your lodging and cost. On the current form are single, double, and triple occupancy for motel, and then dorm. Being a kids camp, we probably only use dorm. But we still can adjust by age, occupancy, number of nights and meals. As I said, it all depends on how you want to designate cost. For our event, we will use an early bird rate, which will be before June 1. And then we will do a regular rate, which will be between June 1 and 10. And then we will also do a late registration, which will be after June 10. Since we only have three options, we can go ahead and delete this extra one because we don't want people to get confused thinking there's another option available. For our cost, the early bird will be $199 per person. The regular will be 225 and after June 10th, it's going to cost 250 per person. Below that, you can see the roommate request option, which being a kids camp, pretty sure kids are going to want to pick their roommate. So we'll go ahead and leave that as is. And additionally, there may be other expenses that you want to add in. So as a kids camp, we have to have a t-shirt. We're going to put that at $10 per shirt, and you can see over here that they can choose their side, size. And then there's workshop options, which currently it says are included in registration fee. You can take that out. You can change it. We're not going to have anything extra included or not, so we're just going to go ahead and delete that section. Below that is where they will figure their costs. So they put in their rooming option, add a t-shirt if they're getting it, or number of t-shirts and then total up the cost there below that is the deposit policy so we're going to start talking money we will have a $25 deposit required when you register for this event and then the remaining balance is going to be on June 25th if it's not paid in full by June 25th we're going to charge a $10 late fee and this section allows them to say how much they're paying now, how, and then what's left after that. Emergency contact, pretty important section, especially for our kids camp. We need to know who we need to call, email, and the relationship to the child. And then below that is the office use section, just to keep track of whether or not the rest of the deposit is 
received, if they owe any more, and if they're waiting on any other registration information. And our Kids Camp registration form is done. The other file in the folder that you downloaded is just a family version, which is set up the same, except that it allows for multiple registrants instead of just one. We hope this helps your registration process. If you have any questions, you can contact the marketing team at 877-833-2272, or you can email info at christianretreatsnetwork.org.